In pole position for the American Grand Prix at Laguna Seca, it's John Kaczynski, the winner of the Japanese GP. But zooming straight into the lead goes young Jimmy Felice, the man who won the American Grand Prix in 1988. Felice has that ultra-wide line into Turn 1, but he's being chased by Jacques Cornu, Carlos Cardas, and the Japanese Grand Prix winner, John Kaczynski. Kaczynski on that works Yamaha in fourth position. That's Felice on the number 65 bike. Carlos Cardas, John Kaczynski, Cornu, Garriga, Cito Pons, Luca Canalora, and Jean-Philippe Rugier. Felice through the corkscrew. In hot pursuit, it's Cardas and John Kaczynski, and Kaczynski goes through to take over second place. Kaczynski flying through on the inside. It didn't look as if there was a gap there at all, but this man is so determined, a definite star in the making. Kaczynski then on the number 19 bike in second place, and it's Americans first and second. Jimmy Felice first, John Kaczynski second. The rest of the field giving chase up the main start and finish straight. And Kaczynski's now challenging for the lead. Felice takes his wide line. Kaczynski ties the inside line, and it's Kaczynski who wins out. John Kaczynski goes through on the inside to take the lead in his home Grand Prix. Juan Garriga there, and Garriga goes off. Juan Garriga, the bike, high-siding him off the track. That rear tyre lost adhesion, then it suddenly gripped and flipped him over the top. The end of the race for Juan Garriga, the runner-up in the world in 1988. But John Kaczynski, well, everything's going his way. He's in the lead from Jimmy Felice in second place. John Kaczynski hoists the front wheel in the air. He's within sight of victory. He takes the chequered flag to win his second Grand Prix of the year. A win then for John Kaczynski from Jim Felice in second place with Luca Cadalora in third spot. And for Cito Pons, fourth place puts him clear by five points in the World Championship standing.